And thanks for your call. Jack in Oakland, Maine. Jack, thank you for calling. You're on with Jaron Lanier. Hi, Tom. So I think that uh, this conversation and ones like it are, are really where the rubber meets the road. Uh, these issues are, are not going away. And it, it, it really reminds me of something that I've seen recently. It's a short film made by a group of computer science scientists in Berkeley. Um, and the whole goal behind it is to show what can happen in, in, with the militarization of, of technologies and data. Um, and the group is called Stop Autonomous Weapons. And it talks all about, in a very dark and almost, you know, twilight zone way, um, the, the potential dangers of, of this. And, um, and what's, it, what's autonomous weapons? The ones that recognize people, you know, fly around and, and take them out? I, we've heard about that on this show now. Is that what you mean, Jack? Yes, it is. And, and so in the video, which is made by, like I said, a group of uh, computer scientists from Berkeley, they're, they're highlighting, you know, how these, with the right, you know, data, these, these can be used by, by groups to seek out political enemies of them, you know, across borders. And, you know, it, it paints a very, very dark picture. And, you know, the, it would be the, the short film starts out with a uh, group of shareholders being pitched this technology. It, you know, in the commercial capacity that we're talking about data today. And, you know, it's all, they, it, they lay it out there like this in a very dark, and straightforward, brutal manner so that people, I think, open their eyes. Jack, we, we've got it. I mean, it sounds like a Hollywood plot. Yeah, and you know, it's funny, that that is an excellent video made by folks here at Berkeley. It's about uh, swarms of little drones that are taken over by hackers and start uh, killing Americans, even though they were intended to attack foreign adversaries. And you know, but the thing is, that doesn't even feel that dark. That just is the ordinary negative scenario we talk about. That's a that's a, a extraordinarily real and um, viable scenario.